Hello YouTube, um, this is an odd video this, it's a taste testing of strawberries, but not the sort that you find in the supermarket, no, these are astronaut strawberries, got this from uh, Manchester Science Museum I think, Science and Technology, which is worth visiting, it really is. Um, so much stuff, really cool. So you got all your sciencey stuff, all your experiments and stuff. And across the road, you got to uh, the aviation museum with planes that are like that that distance away. You could almost stroke them if you were that strange. So astronaut strawberries. They are freeze dried strawberries. How much do they weigh? They weigh. 0 0.5 ounces, that's 14 grams in metric, so they are very, very light. I don't know how many there are in there, um, but it's made in the USA. Uh, thank you. Uh, let's see what we've got. Typical values per 100 gram pack. You've got energy, is 209 kilojoules. Or uh, 50 kilocalories. Fat, 0 grams, of which saturates are 0 grams. Carbohydrates, 13 grams, of which sugars, 0 grams. Fiber, 0 grams. Protein, 0 grams. Salt, 0 grams. So, 13 grams of this is carbohydrate. What's the other one, uh, 1 gram of it? Let's just be something because it doesn't, doesn't say it's got fiber ingredients strawberries produced in a facility that produces milk processes nuts milk soy wheat gluten and eggs so if you're any tolerant to any of those uh, you best keep away uh, freeze dry ready to eat strawberries how does it look and taste freeze drying is is like suspended animation because it keeps the strawberries totally intact but without the water. As you eat the fruits, your mouth rehydrates the strawberries, restoring it to its original state. Freeze dried strawberries can be stored for many years without refrigeration, so that's good for all you preppers out there. Uh, and it's also very light for all you campers out there. Uh, without refrigeration, as long as you keep them uh, in an airtight sealed container. Uh, astronaut foods. Enjoy your strawberries just as the astronauts do. The freeze dried way. Sorry, the freeze dried way. Mm. Astronaut strawberries, as well as other freeze dried food items, which I have, uh, have been aboard space missions since the early Mercury missions. They continue to be used on NASA missions today. I don't know if they look like this. They might have less imagery on it. It might just say space food strawberries. But it'll be in a uh, similar sort of pack though. Uh, be uh, best, best Buy 070519 in this case of which today is the 21st of fifth of eighteen, so but they, incre they are in incredibly light. So <clears throat> don't know how they're going to work. Someone said that the you dip them in water, and of which I have got a little a cup of water here. Come on. Um. If you dip them in water, it rehydrates. It says in, on this, it rehydrates in your mouth. Another one said it rehydrates in your stomach. So, this is completely new to me. Right? It's completely sealed. So, let's see what if I am brave enough. Powder. Let's see if I can be an astronaut and eat this food. Ooh! God! Smells of strawberries. 
sort of. That, there you go, that is a freeze dried strawberry. It actually looks and feels like foam. Yeah. So you're going to be eating like styrofoam. I'm not looking forward to this, to be honest. Should be alright. If astronauts eat it, why can't I? Stuck to my mouth. Got some seeds in my teeth. I'm get many. Hmm. I can see where they're coming from. If you've been up in space for a long period of time, they don't. They don't taste like earthly strawberries. But if you've been in space uh, for a long time and you have some strawberries, it's going to taste fantastic. And in survival situation, or camping situation, I suppose it's alright. It's got a weird texture in your mouth. It tastes like... Um, You get you get those um, like sherbet rock things. It's not it's not like candy rock. It's not uh, glucose. It's a like a sherbet. You just bite into it like chalk. And I see honestly, as soon as the saliva touches it, because that's where the taste is, it uh, it does start coming through. But I wouldn't have a pack. A day, to be honest. I'd rather just have ordinary fresh from the supermarket. And that one, that's one that's been squashed. Now this one, I shall put it in water. Let's see what it does. Starting to look like strawberry colour now rather than <laughs> yeah, let's try. Oh, don't 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 lose, don't lose, don't lose, it's losing grip. The bit that's been soaked in water that is as soft as a strawberry. It's more, yeah, if you dunk it in water first, suck it in water first and then eat it, it's more strawberry -y, 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 y in that state, to what we know from Earth, than in its ordinary dry state. It's got that texture of an ordinary strawberry, quite, quite ripe, really juicy. It tastes a bit old though, been left out in the air for a bit, but... As I said, if you're in space or whatever, I wouldn't complain. So it's alright. So, yeah, I hope this in video was informative. Let's see what it did to the water. No, you need some, a bit more uh, strawberries in there to make it flavoursome. Right, that is it for this one. I shall do a review on an ice cream sandwich for astronauts. Let's see what that does.